Hi everyone, I'm back with another video like this, nice vlog type of thing. I really got to get a boom mic because if you listen really carefully, you're going to hear a lot of white noise in the background. I apologize for that. I haven't been able to find a good one at an affordable price. Uh, I don't want to pay hundreds and hundreds of dollars here. Anyways, you'll notice I've got a whole new do. Uh, it was time for a change and um, well, yeah. This is it. I look a little bit more preppy now, but anyway, whatever. We'll see how this goes, and we'll see how long it lasts. Uh, the purpose of today's video was to talk about some books, believe it or not. Uh, you'll see where I'm going in, in just, a, just a few minutes. Um, I purchased George R. R. Martin's The Ice Dragon. Um, this one was... Well, I'm a huge fan of the ice... Uh, the ice... The Song of Ice and Fire, and this particular book uh, fits in within that universe. I, I haven't read it yet, but um, I believe it's it's aimed at children. It sure looks like it, if you can see from the writing inside. So it's a nice, thin little book, so I'll plow through that one probably in, oh, I don't know, two hours or so. Uh, then there was this bad boy, which is George R. R. Martin's The World of Ice and Fire. A uh, significantly bigger book. It's a coffee table book. I haven't opened it up just yet. Um, it's got a whole bunch of illustrations and talks about the history of the Song of Ice and Fire, which, like I said, I'm a massive fan. For those that don't know, or, well, you, you probably know of Game of Thrones, well, this is what the TV show was inspired by. I'm a huge fan of uh, the series, uh, particularly of the books. So I'm, uh, I've been really eagerly looking forward to this one, especially delving into some of the history of the different families. And um, apparently there's like hundreds, well, hundreds? I think it was 170? 100, yeah, 170 original pieces of art were done for this. So I'm really looking forward to that. Um, this is going to be what I'm going to be reading before bedtime for the next month or so, most likely. Or, well, maybe not. It's not quite that thick, but yeah. So the other thing... Um, I wanted to do like a little unboxing of this. Uh, what you'll see here is it says CGR or Classic Game Room. And if you don't know, Mark from um, Classic Game Room, he he's actually uh, an artist and he draw well he was going to draw a comic and he wanted to make a real nice graphic novel and so he did a Kickstarter for it and well, here it is. And I purchased this because, well number one, I'm a fan of the show. If you don't watch Classic Game Room and you're watching this channel, I'd be really surprised, mainly because we deal with a lot of retro stuff and Mark is like the retro king and it's his humor is just brilliant. So I wanted to support him. I, I wanted to, to show, you know, that uh, the as a fan that I was interested in seeing some of his other works. So I was really curious to get my hands on this and it just arrived. So I'm going to try my best. I did not bring my knife with me, which is probably an epic fail. Oh no, we got this. Perfect. Little cat, which you guys can't see is just off to the side there. So don't be surprised if he, uh, He's looking at the tripod, wondering what the hell is going on. And now he's getting scared and running away. All right. Let's put this here, whatever. Okay, so. All right, what do we got? Okay, just whatever. All right. So here it is, All Hail Me, Lord Carnage, Book One, by Mark. Oh, and I think, how does he spell, yeah, it's a bustler is how he says his name. And I'm 139 of 275, and he actually signed it on the back. All Hail Lord Carnage. Don't know how well that's going to come up, but there it is. That's a nice little, it's got a little uh, dust protector, sleeve, whatever. And then we've got some papers here. It says, uh, Happy Lord Carnage Appreciation Day. Seriously, isn't that every day? Yay, Classic Game Room is excited to deliver your Lord Carnage. Let me put it here. I'm having trouble seeing through the, with the light. Your Lord Carnage Book One Kickstarter Backer Reward to you. 
Uh, we'd like to thank you again for your support during our campaign, which was fully funded in only five days. Go ahead, give yourself a pat on the back. You deserve it. In this special Lord Carnage approved package, you'll find everything except your digital items which exist in the digital universe. For those, please take a moment to log into your CGR account at da da da, and then it's giving you, a, a, like, telling you how to do it and whatever. All right? Uh, we also received this, issue number one, coming early 2015. Look for a Kickstarter in December 2014. What is this? Ethel the Cyborg Ninja. Ethel the Cyborg Ninja. Ninja. Unbelievable. So I guess he's going to be doing another one if he's saying look for the Kickstarter in December. As you can see right there. That's pretty cool. Nice little way to advertise. And I obviously haven't read this yet, but I want to open this up. Oh, there's... Oh, cool. All right. All right. Hold on. There's there's more goodies in here. So let's um, let's see what we got. Okay, we got a little sticker here that says "All Hail Lord Carnage," LordCarnage.com. We've got a sign here that says "Oh yeah, 32x Mark." Really nice. He's he's a talented man, that Mark. Very, very talented. Then he writes, uh, Jared, thank you. And another little thing here. And then inside, he's got the Intergalactic Space Arcade, version 1.2 by Classic Game Room. And again, signed by Mark here. Nice big poster. And then inside my book, it says, Jared, thank you for your... I can't even read his handwriting. What? Thank you for your... <laughs> I can't even read this. Super rad... Oh, God. Okay, anyway. Thank you for backing my book. Well, here we go. It's cool that it's all like autographed and everything. I really like that. So there you go, guys. And now I just wanna wanted to like flip in to show you he's talking a little bit about the actual thing, but this is the way he broke it all down. Alright. Just give you a quick little idea. And is there anything in the end? All right. Well, I don't want to uh, spoil the whole book for you guys. I don't know if this is actually going to be available anywhere or not, but uh, if you like Mark's humor, I would definitely suggest you go and check this out. He's a very talented artist. And his humor is just brilliant. So, I mean, obviously, I'm, I could tell you guys, go and check out ClassicGameRoom.com, but I'm sure most of you are already subs over there. But, yeah, so there we go, guys. That's the uh, Lord Carnage Book 1, a little unboxing video, an overview, uh, from Classic Game Room's Mark Bussler. So, um, that's it. Thank you very much for watching. I'll be back soon with another video.